What's going on guys? Today I'm going to show you how to order an array of names and order by last name. So I have an array of names here saved to a constant called names and we have a method we can call called sort and by default this will order the array of strings in alphabetical order but starting at the first character which for us would be the first name and we want to do the last name. Uh, but this method can take two parameters that we can send in and then write a function on how to compare those parameters. So we'll call those two parameters name1, name2. And then for the function on how to compare these, we need to target the last name. So Let's say for the first name, because these are the two placeholders, they'll kind of go through all these names and compare them. And so for the first one, we want to target the last name, and we can call the split method on that. And what the split method does is it splits a string into an array of substrings. And so what we can do is send in a separator on where we want the split method to split the string. So we'll just send in a space because that's between our first and last name. And so now we have an array of two names. So we'll select the second item in the array by putting a one there because arrays are zero based. They start at zero. So now this is the second name of each name that iterates through the last name. Now we want to compare that last name to the other last name for the second parameter, name2. And to compare a string into another string, there's actually another method that we can call for that called locale compare. And what that does is you call that on a string, which this is a last name, and then you pass in the string you want to compare it to. And so that's where we'll do the name two parameters last name. Let's be name two, split method on that with a space separator. And then we'll select the second name of that array of names. And that is the other last name that's getting compared to the first last name. And so now, if we console.log names, save the file, run node array.js, the name of this file, we get the array ordered in alphabetical order by last name. Now, one thing you should know is that this sort method actually changes the array that is called on. Notice we just console.log names and we had our array in order of last name. So that actually changed our original data. And if you want to prevent that, so you will make a const called ordered names. And we'll start with an empty array. And then we can use the spread operator which is three dots and then the name of the array or object that you want to send in to another array or object. And then you can add or manipulate that without changing the original array or object. So now we can just bring all of our logic onto this array. And then that will affect this ordered names array and the names array will stay the same. So ordered names. Run that. There we go. And then the names array, I guess I'll show you here, is left untouched. So I hope this video helped you not only learn how to put an array of names in order by last name, which is good to know. I feel like you could come across that situation multiple times, 
but also gave you a better idea of the different methods you can call on arrays, chain them together, better manipulate arrays, and have more control over it. And that's all for today, and as always, thank you for watching. Check it.